Okay, yeah, so the, these traps are made of poly pipe. Uh, we used to use the old cage traps for uh, treadle traps for catching devils, but um, they don't really do very well in wire. They tend to bite a lot. So the, these traps are actually really good because they've got a solid front. They can't really rub their nose on there or, or, or hurt themselves. Yeah. They're white, so they're quite insulative. And when they're, when they're shut off, they pro provide a nice little sort of uh, area for the animals to keep away. They don't have any external pressures as well. Okay. So pretty much you can grab an animal, uh, you can come up and put a sack around it, slide them from the tube into a sack, which makes them easy to handle and they're really quick and easy to clean. And that's another thing, we've got to make sure that everything is as clean as we can possibly get it every time. So yeah. these are perfect for what we're after. And they're qu very quick to set too. It's a matter of moving the trap set pin and popping it in there. So how long would my uh, devil be in there? Oh, um, well, right. Yeah, well, it, it depends what time the devil actually goes into a trap. Quolls tend to go into traps quite early in the night, so probably just after it gets dark. But devils may not enter these traps until sort of four or five in the morning. And we, we try and get here sort of six or seven yeah. after usually first light. Um, so they might only spend two or three hours in there. A lot of the time it's really interesting. You get to a trap and you open it up and the animal's asleep and he's just sometimes snoring. It's, it's quite amazing. But these animals are usually incredibly docile, very different from what people see them as. I mean, this whole Warner Brothers sort of cartoon where you've got this swirling devil cruising along like a tornado is just not what they're like. It's probably caused a lot of deaths to animals in the past because of that reputation. They're, they're probably the easiest animal ever to handle, which is great for us, you know, it makes it easy to work on them. So when we get here and there's a devil in it, we uh, work pretty quick and just slide them into a sack and, and get the processing done fairly quickly and then set these traps up and we're ready to go again.